Hey everyone, this is Bruce back with another video, and today I'm going to be going over uh, the results of SummerSlam. <clears throat> so the first match that happened was the Raw Women's Title match. Bianca Belair defending against Becky Lynch, and Bianca won. Then after the match, there was a show of respect between the two, which I did not expect. And what followed, I even more didn't expect. Uh, Bailey, Dakota Kai, and Io Shirai, or Io Sky, or whatever they call her now, made their returns. Uh, looked like they were about to gang up on Bianca, but Becky came in to help. Without really much of a throw down or anything like that, just a little stare down between them to close that match. And then we had uh, Logan Paul versus The Miz. <clears throat> and there were quite a few different shenanigans in that. Like Champa uh, attacking when the referee wasn't paying attention. And then tried it again, but the referee caught him that next time. Tried to get Champ out of the arena, or out of the that area anyway. Uh, <clears throat> and Champ refused, so AJ Styles came out, and they had a little bit of brawl there, which led to some more traction. Uh, Miz tried to cheat. Maurice tried to get involved, but Logan Paul ended up getting the win, hitting Miz with his own with. Mrs. Owen Skullcrunch finale to get the win. So, so I was totally surprised by that. <clears throat> then, it was Bobby Lashley defending the United States title against Theory. And Lashley ended up winning that. Despite Theory's best efforts to try to beat him down before the match could even begin with the briefcase. And then it was the Mysterious vs. Judgment Day, and Edge made his return during that match <clears throat> to help the Mysterios <clears throat> get the victory over Judgment Day. <clears throat> then Pat McAfee beat Corbin, Drew McIntyre showed up to promote Clash at the Castle. Usos ended up defeating Tree Profits in the tag match for the tag titles. I'm not really too happy about that. <clears throat> but kind of expected it. Still doesn't make it any better. Then, surprisingly, Riddle showed up and had a bit of a brawl with Seth Rollins. Rollins ended up stomping him again. So, yeah, that happened. And at some point during the in betweens, they had the Mass of Man Models skit, which is just kind of stupid. Don't really get why they're doing that, but it was just there. <clears throat> then it was the SmackDown with Saddle Match. Uh, Liv Morgan defending against Ronda Rousey. And had a little bit of a controversial finish there. <clears throat> because Rousey had the armbar locked in. And apparently like, Rousey's shoulder was on the mat. Uh, so the referee counted the three and Liv did tap out like before the three. But the referee didn't see that. So that happened. And understandably uh, Ronda was not too happy about that. It is what it is. For now. And, uh, since they were in Tennessee, they had Kane, who's the mayor of Knoxville now, uh, coming out to announce the attendance. Can't remember how much it was, but like close to 50,000. 
Then it was the excuse me, the last man standing match between Brock Lesnar and Roman Reigns for the undisputed title. Uh, a lot of craziness happened there. Like Brock Lesnar used an attractor. <clears throat> Theory tried to cash in near the end, but much like his attempts at beating Lashley, he failed. But it didn't. They didn't announce like, "Oh, Theory's cashing in his money in the bank." None of so. Not really sure if he still has the briefcase or not. But I have to wait and see on that. And unsurprisingly, but. No, I was gonna say. Yeah. Uh, frustratingly and unsurprisingly, Roman Reigns won. And of course, much like how things have been done a lot recently, Roman didn't do it by itself. Had the Usos helping him. Had Heyman to an extent helping him. And I guess you can say Theory in a way kind of helped him. Ended up dumping a whole bunch of stuff on top of Lesnar and came down, which was really stupid. But, yeah. Anyway, that's all for that. <coughs> yeah, like this video, give it a thumbs up, and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And uh, with that, I'll see you next time.